Those who are looking for a great place to live, work, and raise a family typically seek out that sweet spot of suburban tranquility and urban energy. A place that's growing to accommodate the ever-changing needs of modern life, but where you can also catch your breath. It's for these reasons that Northeast Texas is catching the eye of many who are considering a move. And there's one city in particular that's experiencing significant growth. Most people associate Greenville with Greenville, South Carolina, yet Greenville, Texas is just outside the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, close enough to enjoy the benefits of international travel, world-class shopping, restaurants, and sporting events, and yet far enough away to enjoy the benefits of suburban living. Greenville has a rich history of hard work and an entrepreneurial spirit that is influencing the city's recent growth. From real estate development to reimagining the academic infrastructure, the city is growing responsibly to accommodate the uptick in residents. Greenville and Hunt County really started in 1846. Our name originally was going to be Pinckneyville after Governor James Pinckney Henderson. Luckily, they decided, no, let's go with Greenville instead after General Thomas Jefferson Green. In the early years, we were mostly farmers. It wasn't until the first railroad came through in 1880 that cotton suddenly became a major business venture for this area. Before that, they just did about 10 bales a year because it had to travel by wagon all the way down to Jefferson, so it just wasn't worth it economically. But within in one year of the train, it went from 10 to over a thousand bales. And so that really set Greenville on the map and exploded our population. Businesses started coming in downtown. We've grown so much and so many neat people have come from a town that's not that big. Audie Murphy was born in a little tiny town called Kingston, which is about 10 minutes north of Greenville. He went overseas and ended up becoming the most decorated soldier of World War II. He was in over 40 films. Probably the most popular one was To Hell and Back, which was based on his life experiences in the Army while he was overseas. Having him grow up in this area and go on to do all the amazing things he did just makes it even more special to be from here. New construction is going crazy. Currently, we have 8,000 lots already platted. We have a thousand different apartments getting ready to get started. We also have a really cool new recreational center that just was approved. It's a $65 million project. We just approved both Cinemark. Within one year, that'll bring 475,000 people to that complex. There just are so many projects that are being approved that the city council are open to, and that has made such a difference. Being an hour from the Metroplex has put us in a wonderful position for growth. A lot of people came to Greenville because of our affordability. That's something that has made us different. So many restaurants are coming to downtown and really building in that not lack but one of the coolest features we have in downtown is the Texan Theater. We have all kinds of singer songwriters come in, different performances. The people that are opening these businesses here in downtown, they're not necessarily big corporations. It's local people investing their local money back into our community. As a new superintendent for Greenville ISD, I'm looking forward to getting to know all of our students, getting to know our staff, and really showcasing all the great things that are happening within our school district. We have students that are going off and competing at the state at the national level. We take great pride in making sure that our staff has all the resources and materials that they need to do great things with our kids. This summer, we plan to do some upgrades to our facilities. When you drive up to the campuses, we want them to be welcome. We want them to feel that when their kids are there, that that's their home. When September 1 comes, our school district is gonna have gone through a little bit of a facelift, but at the same time, really kicking off our goals. One team, one vision. I can wholeheartedly say I'm excited to be here and be part of the team. Greenville, Texas is a thriving city where every corner holds endless opportunities for fun and growth. So I have lived in Greenville literally all of my life. I was born at the Greenville Hospital. <laughs> when I tell you I love Greenville, I truly love Greenville. We've had opportunities to move away, but this is our home. I had a show called Heart of Greenville and I sat down with local people and would hear their story. And one of the questions was always, what do you love about Greenville? And the answer was almost always the same. And it's the people. It really is the people. When you have a need in this community, there is always a group of individuals who are gonna come together for you. We used to be known in the World Book of Records for having the most churches per capita. There's such a sense of community inside of our churches. They get out into the community and do things for the community. I first moved here actually for the job. I have a museum background. 
And so uh, when the job opening opened up here, I decided to give it a try and fell in love with the museum and the city. And that was 17 years ago, uh, this month actually and I've been here ever since. Everybody's really nice and friendly. You always run into people you know when you're out and about, and there's always something to do. You know, you still have that small town feel, but you're not that far away from the bigger Dallas area if you wanted to go that far and, and do that. It's only like 30 minutes. There's so much to do just right here in your own backyard. It's just been a breath of fresh air. Everywhere we've been, we've been accepted with open arms. We've joined a local church. We feel right at home. The transition here has been smooth. Just looking forward to great things here. I was raised in a place very similar to Greenville, and so those down-home values have made such an impact. They treat you like family. They open their doors. They want to sit down with you and have a conversation. And that's the type of community that I want to raise my children in. That's the type of community that uh, we want to see our family grow in. Whether you're looking to start a new business in a growing city or simply want to relocate for a change of pace, Greenville, Texas checks every box. Greenville is one of the fastest growing cities in Texas. Growth always presents challenges, but we're steadfast in our commitment to grow without compromising our friendly hometown values. And this is what makes Greenville attractive to homeowners retail establishments, and commercial businesses. We host one of the largest employers in Northeast Texas, L3 Harris, where they have been producing airborne reconnaissance, surveillance, and intelligence systems for over 50 years. We also host several Fortune 2000 companies that produce leading plastic products, food packaging, and dairy products. Greenville has much to offer for those looking to live, locate, or expand their business. Mild weather around four distinct changes of the season, we have educational opportunities starting with pre-K, STEM, and postgraduate degrees. We have special events for everyone, including the Greenville Municipal Auditorium, the Audie Murphy Museum, the 4th of July activities, and the Christmas Parade. I've lived in Greenville for over 50 years. Living in Greenville and locating my business here was always a choice for me. It's a wonderful place to live and raise a family. To learn more about our vibrant city, visit us online or call the number on your screen.